very excited, and they're very excited, of course, because the Fisher Cats are ahead. Now, there was rain, a little bit of cold weather today, but that didn't slow down the Fisher Cats, and that didn't stop the fans from filing in the stadium today. And right now, we're in the top of the ninth, and it's 6 to 0 Fisher Cats. Rain, fog, and 40 degree temps didn't keep the diehard fans away from Northeast Delta Dental Stadium. No, the rain is not keeping us away. Even when it's cold and rainy, we're here. I'm fine going out in the weather, but I think I'm fine with it. The New Hampshire Fisher Cats faced off against the New Britain Rock Cats in their home opener Friday. Opening day was supposed to be Thursday, but was postponed thanks to Wednesday's snow. That forced some fans to change plans. Me and my dad did the Fisher Cat 5K. Uh, I'm pretty sure the Thanksgiving one, and we got tickets, but since it got rained out, we couldn't go. I was excited for the game tonight because I thought the opening day was going to be yesterday, but now it's today, so now I'm really excited because it's opening day today. Gavin and his friend Jake play in hooks at Little League and cheered on their favorite team. I'm just hoping the uh, Fisher Cats crush the Great Britain. Others stayed warm with a hot date. Not me. I'm pretty much. I don't care about the weather. <laughs> I'm good. I have him. He can keep me toasted warm. So and watch the game. We do have the right idea. It's a kind of cold night tonight, but we're having a lot of fun. Rain or shine, nothing stands between a Fisher Cats fan and what's really important. It's a little rainy and cold outside. Does that make you think twice about coming? No, not really. I just really wanted pretzel. Although today was a little bit tough, organizers are hoping for a better game tomorrow for All You Can Eat Saturday and the second game against New Britain. Live in Manchester, Stephanie Woods, WMUR News 9.